Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Holly. Today I'm gonna be filming the week of February 27th in my personal So Much Crafting inserts. And the kit I'm gonna be using is this little kit from Soda Pop Studio. It's such a cute kit. I thought this was really fun for like the transition between February and March, kind of with the pinks and the greens. And so I picked up this two page vertical kind of base kit, which has like a lot of the checklist, a cute quote box, tons of icons and functional deco, some headers. And then the second page is just like perfect for the personal planner. So you get um, some kind of header washi strips there, a bunch of quarter boxes, a bunch of half boxes, habit trackers, a weekly ombre, a little checklist and a payday flag. And then I also just picked up, because I do like to have um, some full boxes, she used to sell these horizontal boxes as just a little four pack, which is actually perfect for the personal planner because they're a little bit shorter. And then you also, um only get like all four, like because I don't normally new, use all all eight. I do think she changed this since I bought that, but um, I still think the horizontal ones are perfectly sized for the personal planner. And then here I got some extra little quarter boxes at the bottom, which was perfect. So I think this is gonna be a really fun format. I'm going to go ahead and pop out my inserts. And so to start, I am gonna go ahead and just put this right up in the corner. I like to have this here. And I think I will use this, I'm debating whether I wanna do it for dinners or for, hmm, for my videos. I think I'll do it for dinners this week and I'll just call it this week. And then I can come up to that space at the top. I'm not sure yet if I want to use um, strips on the inside. I'm gonna do it without them at first and see if it looks like decorative enough. I just think sometimes it can look like a little bit overkill when you have that and like a really decorative spread, but we'll see how it ends up. Just straightening that out there. Okay, and then on to the week. So on Monday, I want to note down that I wanna to go to spin class that morning. So for that, I'm gonna take one of these little scalloped flags or scalloped boxes. And then to note down spin class, I'm gonna use a bike here from Planning Roses. And I think this, hmm, which color? We'll use this red bike up here. Obviously spinning does not use a real bike, but I still think those are cute. And then I, otherwise that day, I am going to happy hour that night. So I'm gonna take one of these printed ones And she have, oh yeah, she has a really cute little wine. So I'll use that and put that here to note down happy hour. And then that's kind of like it that day. So I'm just gonna take these two little, like some headers at the bottom of the day, just to fill in some of the space to be a little more decorative. Cause I don't really have any other reminders. Like I need to change my contacts, but I don't need to put that in this planner cause that's already in my Erin Condren. So I'll just fill this up here. Kind of use that as washi, very cute. And then on to Tuesday, Tuesday morning, I don't have anything going on. Tuesday after work, I want to go to an exercise class with my husband. So I'll just take this. And I did get the Soda Pop Studio stickers in matte um, and they are working fairly nice with the So Much Crafting Paper. Um, as I've mentioned in a lot of these videos, the So Much Crafting Paper is just crazy, crazy delicate. Like you just have to be really, really like gentle with it. So I tried to do that and I think, I don't think, oh, she does have like these little icons. I think I'll save that for a different day and instead dig out. Maybe my little um, Piper Paper Company stickers. I think these are cute with the little kettlebell. So I'll put that down there. And then also that night I have some TV shows on. So I think she has a little TV here. And then I'm gonna layer that over a decorative little flag. Actually, I'll use a bigger one. This one's a little bigger. Put this on top of that to write those in. 
So I'll put that down there. And then I also do need to mark down, I think I'm gonna have some like editing to do that night. So I want to take maybe this little laptop and I'm gonna put down like, do it like this here. And then I'll just put these two little, like I'll make like a little list out of these two hearts to note the different things I wanna edit. And then on to Wednesday. Wednesday, I really don't have that much going on, so I think I'm gonna take one of these decorative full boxes. I think I'll take the Hello Love one because I'm gonna use this quote box on my grid bar. So I'll just stick this right in there. And then the only thing I really want to mark down on Wednesday is that I am taking a my new supervisee out to lunch. Oh, and I also do have a bill due. Although that one's kind of like automatic, so I'm not gonna mark that one down. I will just take, I'm gonna take a different color. So we have a little variety. I'm gonna do the peach. And I, I'm gonna take this food one. And I'm hoping at that point, like in the week, I'm like fairly done with a lot of my editing. I'm trying really hard to front load my editing like on Monday or Tuesday night. So I don't feel like I'm editing every night of the week lately. Like uh, for a little bit, I was uploading a lot and I felt like every single night I had to edit and it was just getting to be a little too much for me. So I'm trying to back off a bit and um, and also try to like get like one concentrated chunk of editing in on Monday or Tuesday So then I don't have to like edit the rest of the week So that's like so hopefully Wednesday night is a chill night is that was a long way of saying that um, and then on to Thursday Thursday, I'm gonna work from home. So to mark that down I'm just gonna take a little exclamation point and I'll just write that at the top of the day and then I do have a dentist appointment that day, so I will note that with maybe one of these plain boxes. Actually, I'll take one of the printed ones here. And I think I'll switch out. I think I'm gonna do this exclamation point on, oops, I tore it. I'm gonna do the exclamation point here and then I'll just put this over there and that'll be kind of the note to work from home and that'll be for the dentist. And then that day, I definitely wanna get a run in. So I will grab a little scallop box. And for that, I'll also take another Piper Paper Co. sticker and I'll just grab this little light pen. Eh, that doesn't go that great. What else? There? I think I could take this, is this green too green? I think we could make that green work. So I'll just put that in to note down my run. And then the final thing I do want to note down that day is that it is trash day and she's this cute little trash sticker. So I'll just put that over top of a flag. So I do have some boxes I want to remember to take out. And then Friday, I don't have that much going on. I think I wanna do like a little treat myself kind of thing in the morning. So I will take, um, I'm gonna take this one because I think it's the prettiest <laughs> and do that. I don't know what I'm doing Friday night yet. I think it's gonna be like a me time kind of night. But in the morning, I'm gonna take this little coffee cup down here, very cute, and put that in. And I can just kind of put, I guess I can put it on top of a teardrop. And then, like I said, Friday night, not sure what's going on. I am going to put a bill due down because I actually do need to pay this bill. I haven't paid it yet. I typically try to pay everything on the first of the month and I have like auto draft, anyway, long story, but I'll put that bill in. And then on to Saturday. So Saturday, definitely first thing I want to, we're gonna get a workout in. So I'm gonna take this final, um, actually I'll take, this little squiggle box here. And I'm going to layer the little dumbbell one from the kit over that and write that in. And then I do wanna go get groceries. So I'm gonna take this little adorable little grocery cart and the little flag. 
And then I think that night I'm gonna be hanging out with a friend, but I have not totally confirmed with her. So I'm just gonna take this half box and I'll leave that blank for now and I can come back and fill that in once I know a little bit better what we're doing. And then finally on Sunday, Sunday's kind of like want to get my um, planning and filming done, want to get a long run in, just kind of a chill Sunday. Get some laundry done. So I'm going to take this box just for some extra decoration. You know what, I might switch out instead of having this here. Oops. No, okay, I'm leaving that there because it's not cooperating. So I will put this, I just feel like it's looking very um, unbalanced to have like the two ha full boxes like out here, but I guess it's fine. I could fill in this space actually, if I'm like worried about that looking too white spacey. Okay, and then I do want to note going for a run, but first I'm gonna put in planning and filming. She has a cute little camera here. So I'll put kind of layer these like this and I can write in next to it. And then I do want to note down that run. So I'll take this final scalloped label. And I will take one of these, I think. I'll take, actually, I'll just come back to the sneakers and I'll grab this sneaker color. I'll grab this one, this one works. Also from Piper Paper Co. And then uh, I just want to use her cute little laundry basket to note down doing some laundry. And I'll just put that on a quarter box because we have them. That little laundry in, and that's pretty much it. I do have TV shows on that night, but I don't think I'm actually going to be able to sit down and watch them. Well, maybe I will, but um, I can mark those down later if I want. And then I do want to move up to this top left here. Um... And I want to do, I might like layer this kind of as washi. And then I'm going to put the little hello up there. And also the balloons, because I didn't really have any occasion for a balloons this week. Yeah, I think that looks cute, decorative. I do feel like this is looking very white spacey, so I'm gonna look into either some date covers or some washi. And I'm sorry if you're just out of frame for that. So what I did was just add the hello sticker in the balloon. And I did find some washi. I think this one that I got from Michaels actually might work. It's not like a perfect match because it has like more green green, but I love this washi, so I'm happy to have an occasion to use it. So I'm gonna go through and lay all this down and then I will punch out the holes as well. Okay guys, so I went ahead and put that washi down. To be honest, on one hand I love it because it's like one of my favorite washies ever. On the other hand, it's kind of driving me crazy that it's not a perfect match and that the greens are like too bright green. Um, but we're gonna we're gonna live with it. We're gonna see how we feel with it this week. Um, and then the final thing I want to do to the main spread is stick down this weekend banner. And I, as always, I'm just gonna cover up these dates because I just like the way that looks. So I think that is very cute. And then I'm gonna move on to my grid bar. And so the grid bar, of course, we're gonna start right out with this quote box up top. And then I do wanna take the two little habit trackers we have in this kit and use those. And then I want to maybe just do, I might do like a priority list for the week of things that like I definitely need to get done. So I'm gonna take this little list here Actually, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna pull in just some of this as like deco and to try to kind of bring the two together. Like the two, like the, the middle and the, what am I trying to say? The grid bar and the regular spread just kind of work. Cause I didn't feel like, I didn't wanna do the interior strip of this cause I feel like you lose a little bit of space, but um, this kind of works them, makes them look Kind of corresponding and also takes up some space and then we can do the important header 
This will be like my priority items for the week. I'm not sure if I'm gonna use it for work priority or personal priority, but TBD. And that is very nice. And then I think at the bottom, I just might use this little quarter box just kind of as like deco. Um, not fill it in just because it is printed and it's hard to tell that the middle is even white out, whited out. So I think that's perfect. And then I'm going to do a to-do list at the top of the back page. And just keeping this pretty simple. And then I'm going to take more of this washi. I do have one full box left I could use, but um, I kind of want to just keep using the washi because I think it looks nice. Totally did the washi crooked. Yikes, yikes, yikes. And I tore the paper. Buckets of fail here. Okay. And then I'm going to do just a short to clean list. And next to that, I'm also just going to put this little, put this little broom, although I definitely don't do brooms. I'll put the little laundry because I definitely do a lot of laundry. So I'll put that kind of just as like a little bit of deco. And then I'll just put this up here as well just to like add a little something. And I'm also gonna put, since one of the things I need to do this week is um, do my March budget with my husband, I'm gonna take this little credit card and note that there so I can remember to put that down. And then finally, I do wanna do a to-go list. I think we can fit in another thing of washi there, right? Yeah, I'm gonna lift up this laundry sticker and I can just layer it over that. And then I'm gonna put this back down here. And then next to the to-go, I am gonna layer, one of the things I need to do is get gas. So I'm gonna put that in right there. Okay, so I think that is it. I'm gonna go ahead and fill everything in and sh come and show you guys the finished look. Okay guys, so here's everything filled in. I started to fill that in and I totally screwed it up and I'm so mad at myself because it looks terrible. Um, so then I just like stopped filling in the rest because I was just so irritated <laughs> um, with myself. And then I did also do my grid bar here. And so I just filled in parts of those that I know so far. I don't know everything. So I'm just gonna pop that in and let me show you what we have left with this kit. This was like the perfect little um, kind of little variety here. So what we have is a few checklists and some icons, but made pretty good use of this, I thought. And then some extra half boxes and quarter boxes. I just happened to not have a payday this week, so I couldn't use that. And over here, just one full box and two of those quarter boxes. So I really liked this combo for the personal. I think it's like gives you a really, really cute decorative white space spread. Um, and I definitely am a fan. So Anyway, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy seeing a personal plan with me. I am debating kind of going back to my traveler's notebook. I might order a new one. Anyway, so more to come on that. Right now I am enjoying my personal, but um, I'm, I'm, I've been playing around with some printables for my traveler's notebook. I'm not ready to fully commit yet, um, but definitely be on the look for that as well if you are kind of an on-the-go planner type of person. And I also do need to change out my decorations here to be more seasonally appropriate. So that will be coming up as well. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and I will be back soon with another video. Bye.